What's going on everyone? Welcome to another tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to extend your display on your laptop or desktop. It's going to be the same method for both. Now this is also a response to a comment that I had recently received asking if I can make a video on how to display your game in full screen on a second monitor. Now this individual has a laptop, a second monitor, Elgato capture card, and a Streamlabs installed. However, whenever they set everything up, they can see the game in a little square on both monitors and Streamlabs. So they want to be able to separate the game screen from Streamlabs, so that way gameplay can be full screen on one monitor and then Streamlabs and chat and everything can be displayed on their laptop. So let's go ahead and look into extending the desktop. So the first thing you want to do is right click on your actual desktop, go to display settings, and you should be presented with the different monitors that you have hooked up. If you don't see these, then what you're going to want to do is make sure everything's powered on, make sure all the connections are tight and secured, and then try identify and detect and see if it populates. Once you have that showing, then you're going to go all the way down here to multiple displays. But before we do anything with this, you want to make sure that you are selecting a main display. For me, it's number one. So then we're going to go to the multiple displays and you want to make sure it has extend desktop to this display. If you do duplicate, it's going to mirror. So with the extend, it's going to extend the information from the first primary one to the next one. With the duplicate, it's going to take everything that is on that one monitor and it's going to completely copy it to the next one. And that's not what you want. So anything that you do in monitor one then gets mirrored over to say monitor two, if you're doing a two monitor setup, that's not what you want. So the reason why you want to have it as extend is so that way this monitor is its own monitor and then this monitor is its own monitor. So that way you can have the gameplay, whether it's PC gaming or if it's console gaming, it will be in the first monitor. That's how I do it. And then with the extend, I go to monitor three, which is my monitor on my left. And that's where all my stream labs or OBS studio or anything else that I'm doing stream related is over there. And then for monitor two, which is the small little TV that I have hooked up over on the right, this one is for web browser, music, anything like that. So that is how I have my setup for everything. And that is why extending is super important. So hopefully that was helpful for the person who had reached out with that comment. And hopefully that explains some things for other people out there who may want to also venture into this too. But if you found this video helpful, be sure to comment, like, share, and subscribe. If there's any other information you'd like to share, drop it in the comments. If you have any questions, drop those in the comments as well. But thank you so much for watching. Check out the channel for more videos, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care.